Hey love bucks, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family, just thank you for the love and support. You know, just being able to know that y'all, you know, um, on the level is level with me and knowing y'all can resonate with the things that I go through you know we're all going through a dark, dark place right now and it's just like you can be good one minute and the next thing you know something throws you right back so you know I'm just glad that we're all on the same page so with that being said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way way and if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already please like and subscribe even hit that notification bell at the bottom so you know when your girl's about to upload her next video also if you are comfortable enough please drop me a line or two I love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me even if it's about the positive feedback or the content of my video or you're just up telling me about your impact again how it impacted your life and head you towards a positive direction and if you feel like uh, the video is giving you good information or even good vibes that um, that you would love to share with the loved one, family, or friend, or even a fellow empath that's going through some really dark times right now. They need validation and confirmation in their life. Please go ahead and share, and um, even give me a thumbs up, like, and also share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit. And once again, thank you so much for stopping by the channel and giving me so much love and support. I am greatly appreciated and I love y'all from the bottom of my heart. And I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video. Y'all, I relaxed. I got my hair done. You know, it's like a, I don't know if you can really see it with my, um, well, you can see it kind of in the, in the light, but it's like really bright purple. And um, repping my dad and then got Michael on my shirt today. So I'm repping them both. God rest their souls. And got me some trail mix. I mean, if you're watching this video, I finally got some trail mix. So I don't want to hear your mouth no more. But anyways, uh, yeah, y'all, I feel so much better. After I took a day off, I did like a 95-minute workout today. Uh, cardio, weight lift, all these different things. I'm going to do me a couple of videos. Go ahead and take me a nature walk and then come back and do me, you know, another 95-minute uh, workout after I do a few more videos. That's like, I have not been able to prioritize myself. But yeah, the video, uh, meditation music that I'm listening to today is 432 Hertz, the deepest healing, letting go of all negative energy, healing meditation music, 432 Hertz, and I will post that link in the description box below. Yes, and my video today is Twin Flame 101, Hey Opus, don't worry, hope is waiting for you in the dark. I was listening to my music today while I was doing my exercises. Um, I usually do uh, Alejandro. Uh, what is it Brazilian butt lift workout I usually do that um, but, but the last few days I've been doing um, Shalene Johnson's turbo jam I used to do that a few years back and I have fun because it's working out everything all at one time and it's just like with Alejandro you got to pick a certain video and it does certain parts but it's like with Shalene she does everything all at one time so I really love those workouts and it really makes me feel good because I was in a dark place y'all been so depressed about my my dad's um, anniversary coming up in a few what did, what did it say uh, oh week after next not this Sunday coming up uh, next Sunday two Sundays is gonna be up and I'm just like Ugh, I'm trying not to think about that because it really puts me in a dark place so lately I've been trying to do you know things that puts a smile on my face and I always tell people that you know because a lot of times there's people that leave me messages like when they get the anger and you know they get you know they're drawing in negative energy they're ready to hit something I always tell people if you know you one of the ones that like put your hands on things <laughs> or ready to punch a wall try to do like kickboxing or you know go go to the to the gym and hit the speed bag or something like that or work out you know do do kickboxing I love doing that as well um you know anything that you can put your hands to use other than hitting people or breaking your hands because I had a bad habit I accidentally hit a wall one time and broke my knuckle so it was not a good thing 
but it's just like I try to do things that really uplift my spirits you know singing I love to watch movies um working out dancing nature walk you know we can just be really put in a bad place you know you could be going through something right now you know going through ascension dark night of the soul spiritual awakening kundalini it can really put you in some places you know it's like you see all these marks on me I got like I keep breaking out on rashes again it's not as bad as it was before Christmas now if you've been with me for a while you've been with me since last year you would know I'm like, oh my god Rosalyn I broke out like that I, I thought I was getting chicken pox all over again it hurt so bad and I guess it was just for me detoxing because I don't you know I don't smoke or drink anymore and it's just like you know that made me feel good but it's just like when you're going through different things you always have to look at the the positive side of it you know it can really put you in a dark place and it is just like you aren't the, the person you were yesterday last week last month you know you even five minutes ago because you're evolving you're changing you have to really see yourself as that you know see yourself as that like because it's like you know good things are coming towards you because you'll start seeing signs that things you know resonate with the things that you're aiming for you're wanting in your life if you don't see a, a, a video like if you're a YouTube you know you, you love YouTube I'll watch YouTube all the time and it's like I go on some of my different YouTubers and try to support everybody that, you know, I'm, uh, that I, I'm subscribed to. And, you know, send love and support, you know, because that's what, you know, I love to do. It's, or I got friends that I support on um, Facebook. I have some spirit girl. She knows who I'm talking about. Uh, she sends out a lot of positive uh, posts. Some of them I use on my, my thumbnails, you know, because I love doing videos where I'm saying a positive, you know, setting a positive example, you know, giving out a positive message, having, you know, positive vibes within the music and sending out a thumbnail because I know how it feels to be in a very dark place. You could be, you could have lost a loved one. Um, going through the divorce, breakup, you know, uh, financial issues, the kids acting up, your, you know, other half, you keep on bumping heads with them, trying to find out where is your next step. And it's just like, it can be confusing, especially when you're stressed out. You know, when 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 you get stressed out, ego, e ego not ego, but ego will get the best of you. E uh, your ego will try to run you run you rapid like you makes you feel like you have to have things right now and it's like you have to be able to get that divine time it's like you can't sit there and wait for it to come but allow yourself while you're waiting for whatever you have gravitating towards your way work on you being a better person try to become your the best version of yourself allow yourself to have your frequency you know rise up you know ascend because it's like it's no need for us to constantly keep dwelling on things we can't change and i have to tell myself that every day it's like everything you're upset about you can't change none of these things you don't have to have your past be a burden for you allow that to give you that milestone to be able to make your for out for a better future because it's like today i you know usually when i was in my dark spot when i tried it was like i had to make myself work out but then it's like if i know i'm putting on weight because i don't smoke anymore i don't have any drinks so i don't have a stress reliever you know if you're a smoker you know that's the first thing you're gonna do is light up a cigarette when you're stressed out or roll up a blunt that's what i used to do but since i don't do these things anymore i became an emotional eater and then i started packing on the weight and i was, I was really small at one time especially you know people were like gosh you smoke weed and you don't eat like that i'm like no i mean that was my <laughs> that was my outlet but now it's like since i wiped all those toxic things out of my life i choose to want to eat um like gummy bears i was eating like kit kats and i just cut chocolate out i don't even eat chocolate anymore um then i got the gummy bears now i don't really eat the gummy bears as much as i did now now i changed changed over to uh what is this fruit and nut trail mix and i got me some almonds as well and i'm drinking a lot of water as well so it's just like I'm I'm so determined. I said I don't like what I look like in the mirror. You know, I'm not comfortable. My daughter gets mad at me when I say that. She's like, Mom, you're not as big as you think you are. I'm like, look, when you're set in a certain way, you, you tend to want to look at the you know, you're trying to change that. And I always feel like anything in your life that you know you can possibly change for yourself to put you in a better attitude, put you in a better vibe, a better frequency, do that. You know? It you shouldn't have to, you know, hate 
yourself because you don't like what you see reflecting back at you when you know you can change those things that's what you need to work on because it's just like we we have a tendency to get stressed out and let allow ego to run us like okay I, whatever i'm aiming for i want this right now it's like with my situation i want my situation to change you know even if i wasn't to go home and meet my family i would love for my my life just to change over because i know i deserve that you know i'm, I'm working towards things now with my videos and being able to counsel and help people i love doing that that is that is my goal that is my career for me to be able to help others like me and it's just like i, I was just like i'm proud of myself because when i first started this i didn't know who i was going to talk to i listened to uh volt i think that's his name oh my gosh i can't remember that guy's name victor victor something i can't remember his last name but he does the same thing i do and he's a, he does the things for the empaths and all that stuff he helped me guide me towards doing this ralph smart from infinite waters guided me to do all this stuff Till Swan, she helped me as well. So it was just like being able to see these people do something. I said, this is what I want to do. You know, this is helping me. So I love what I do. I'm love. I love to where I when I'm going through a certain issue and being able to make a video about it and be an open book. You know what I'm saying? Because it's like nobody's perfect. You know, we have those days where it can get frustrating at times, and you're like, oh, I'm tired of going through different things. I'm tired of going through that 11 11. So it's just like allow yourself to be able to raise your frequency anything that you enjoy yourself doing do that you know there's no reason for you to stay in a dark place you know that light that hope of light is waiting for you all you have to do is just turn the light on so you know just just if you meditate meditate if you need to walk out you know in nature and get your answers if you have any questions about your life yourself you know all all you got to do is just take your time in nature and I, that's why i love it because i i always tell people i love do, doing nature walks now because a month month two three months ago i hated going outside i would do my videos and go right to sleep because i was that depressed but i said you know i get cabin fever let me get the heck up out of this house you know the nature ha nature has something to say to me so i'm gonna go see what nature has to say so i love it when they speak so it's just like when you go through different things allow yourself to go through that that time those chain of events but allow yourself to know you know whatever you can change you can do that because if you want change in your life you have to be that change you can't sit up here and wait for things to fall in your lap it's not going to happen that way you know universe wants to see are they working towards the things that they really truly want in their life are they doing the things that they need to do to rise above everything and they using the the pot you know the negative impacts or the ne negative uh situations to use that as a milestone to get to a higher place in their frequency so you need to go ahead and do that and be you know be hopeful for everything because you got to be able to believe in yourself and have that confidence in yourself that things will turn around for you but if you have that negative if you're constantly and i have to get myself as well don't concentrate on the things you don't have in your life don't concentrate saying i don't want to do when you keep doing that i don't want and then you're adding something to your life that you know you you're ready to get away from just allow yourself to say universe i'm i'm ready to be in a better spot i'm ready to be in a better place in a better a better atmosphere better, better frequency but don't focus on the things that you are trying to get away from because when you keep talking about the things you're trying to get away from you tend to stay in it a little bit longer so i had to keep telling myself that and kick myself in the arse for doing that so you know just allow yourself to be able to do that do what you enjoy do what you mean that helps you make be happy and you know better days are coming so i hope you were able to resonate with the content of my videos send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can tgi friday i hope y'all have a blessed safe weekend be responsible at everything you do send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can know that you are truly blessed highly favored and forever loved and knowing there's always somebody out there praying for you better days and shout out goes to uh lost puppy diamond king and passive restraint productions i much love to see you later Love you. Holla.